So the next question says, a water bucket of mass M is revolved in a vertical circle with the help of rope of length R. If the velocity of the bucket at the lowest point is root 7 gr, then the velocity and tension in the rope at the highest point will be. So let's call this velocity as V dash. First, to find the velocity, I'm going to use law of conservation of energy and would say this point is A, this point as B. And I can say the total energy at A remains constant as total energy as B by law of conservation of energy. Now the total energy at A is just the kinetic energy. And the total energy at B is going to be the potential energy plus the kinetic energy. You can see this is V and this is V dash velocity at A and V dash velocity at B. Now here H is something which is very interesting. H is the distance between point A and B, the displacement I should say, which is nothing but the diameter of the circle, which is nothing but 2R. So remember H over here is 2R and definitely before substituting that H, I can cancel this M throughout and multiply by 2 throughout will give me V square is equal to 2g instead of h I can substitute 2r plus v dash square that gives me v dash square as v square minus 4gr now if you remember v was root 7gr squaring and substituting it over here we get 7gr minus 4gr as 3gr which is v dash square so v dash is nothing but root 3gr that's the velocity we found over here. Now we also want to find the tension at this point. I can say at this point the forces acting are mg and tension in one direction which is downward and CFF in the opposite direction. So this body is experiencing these two forces because of which it will be getting balanced. So I can say mg plus the tension is CFF. mg remains as it is, tension remains as it is. CFF I can write it as mv dash square by r. V dash is the velocity at that point B, which is root 3 gr, which I can substitute over here. So mg plus tension is going to be m into 3 gr by r. r will get cancelled. I'll get 3 mg. This minus mg, the tension will become 2 mg.